If you've seen the 2004 disaster movie, The Day After Tomorrow, you probably remember the catastrophic effects of global warming, the melting of polar ice caps and glaciers, leading to a shutdown of the Atlantic meridional overturning circulation, a crucial ocean current that regulates global weather patterns. The Atlantic Ocean, with its vast expanse, holds within it a complex network of ocean currents, including the Atlantic Meridional Overturning Circulation, AMOC, which stands out as a crucial player in regulating Earth's climate. This immense conveyor belt of water, heat, and salt serves as a fundamental component of the planet's climate system. But recent scientific discoveries suggest a potential crisis on the horizon. Join us as we delve into the depths of the AMOC, uncovering its mysteries and facing the reality of its potential collapse. At its essence, the AMOC functions as a symphony of movement, directing the flow of water from the frigid depths of the Southern Ocean to the sunlit shores of the Northern Hemisphere. This intricate circulation, driven by the interaction of temperature and salinity, serves as the cornerstone of Earth's climate system. The process initiates with the descent of dense cold water in the North Atlantic, setting off a downward current that propels warm, salty water towards the poles. This complex choreography, known as thermohaline circulation, drives the engine of global climate, influencing weather patterns and sustaining ecosystems worldwide. Beneath the seemingly calm surface of the ocean lies an impending crisis. Recent studies indicate that the once stable Atlantic Meridional Overturning Circulation AMOC, is now teetering on the edge of collapse. The ramifications of such an event would be dire, setting off a chain reaction of climatic disturbances with far-reaching consequences. When this collapse occurs, it would unleash profound implications, including rising sea levels, exacerbated global warming, disruptions to marine ecosystems, and disruptions to biogeochemical cycles. Food security would be under significant threat, and highly productive marine ecosystems along the western coast of South Africa and Namibia, such as the most productive system of its kind in the Atlantic, would suffer severe impacts. Europe could face a substantial cooling of approximately 5 to 10 degrees Celsius, while tropical regions might experience intensified heat. Various parts of the world would grapple with severe droughts and increased flooding, exacerbating existing environmental challenges. Moreover, the acidity of the world's oceans would increase, posing further risks to marine life and ecosystems. Evidence from past events sheds light on the potential consequences of AMOC disruptions. For instance, Northern Europe experienced two severe winters from 2009 to 2011, which were linked to a temporary slowdown of the AMOC. During this period, heat accumulated in the tropics, contributing to an unusually active hurricane season in 2010. In 2013, a cold anomaly, known as a cold blob, emerged in the North Atlantic, peaking in the summer of 2015. This coincided with heat waves in Central Europe, demonstrating the complex interplay of ocean currents and atmospheric conditions in shaping regional climates. While the cold blob phenomenon bore some similarities to the characteristics of a weakened AMOC, subsequent analysis dismissed any direct causal connection with AMOC weakening. Instead, the transient episode was attributed to localized atmospheric influences. Nonetheless, this event provided valuable insights into the potential effects of anomalous temperature patterns, which could result from AMOC weakening on a larger scale. Even though this particular instance did not originate from AMOC weakening, it hinted at the broader impacts such changes could have on regional climates. In the pursuit of understanding the fate of AMOC, scientists have employed advanced modeling techniques and state-of-the-art technology. Recent research, led by prestigious institutions like Utrecht University, has illuminated the mechanisms driving AMOC variability. Through comprehensive simulations spanning over 2,200 years, researchers integrated the influence of human-induced climate change into their analysis. Within 1,750 years of simulation, an abrupt collapse of AMOC was observed, 
highlighting the vulnerability of this crucial oceanic circulation system. Key drivers of AMOC collapse, such as the melting of Greenland's ice sheet and the influx of freshwater into the North Atlantic, have been identified. These findings emphasize the urgent need for proactive measures to mitigate the impacts of climate change and preserve the stability of Earth's climate system. From reducing carbon emissions to investing in renewable energy and conservation efforts, the solutions are within our grasp. The time to act is now, for the fate of our planet and future generations hangs in the balance.